Well, students at Central Michigan University are exploring the link between contaminated waterways and the, cre the decreasing number of mussel species. According to one of the researchers, the 45 Michigan species and the 300 across North America, approximately three quarters of the mussel species are rare or in danger of extinction. Mussels not only remove the fine organic matter found in the water, they also contend with herbicides, medicines, toothpaste, perfumes, and the other chemicals that find their way into the water. And mussels are the perfect little natural mediators. They're these tiny little living rocks that just filter out water and clean up the ecosystem. And so a lot of times, you know, you don't need a lot of these expensive remediation methods. You just need to bring back the native mussel population to really clean up the habitat. But all the chemicals could be taking a toll on the mussels. With help from the Great Lakes Restoration Initiative, the students and faculty have set up two environments for the mussels. One that explores the effects of medicine and other urban type runoff, and another that is simulating agricultural runoff. They'll study the effects of the chemicals on the mussels and largemouth bass, a fish species that is vital to the mussels. Researchers are hopeful that their research can help understand more about what is causing the declining mussel population.